marker. That was uh, 1995. Uh, Since then, and now I'm here, and then uh, I really hope uh, uh, to enjoy uh, the uh, Nobel Week uh, this week. So, and then I hope that the uh, holding uh, receiving this uh, Nobel Prize, um, uh, the our society uh, will recognize uh, that uh, the importance of um, uh, medical sciences and uh, medical research. And, and then also I told the government that, well, it's important to support uh, the basic sciences. My understanding is that, uh, uh, well, this year a uh, Nobel Prize, it was, um, it was for um, peripheral immunotherapies. Uh, that is the important uh, notion in immunology, uh, how the, uh, the immune responses against uh, our self-constituent, how we, it is prevented or suppressed. And then you are to your uh, second question about uh, the clinical application. The immunology is a very really interesting uh, science, scientific discipline. Uh, uh, the, uh, in, in which uh, the uh, basic uh, science and the uh, clinical science is really close. If you find something as basic immunology, and it can be easily translated to, to the clinic. Uh, but um, of course, uh, make uh, the, uh, the, uh, the uh, developing a new, new treatment, a way of prevention, it may take time. But um, it's still it looks like it's still an early stage for clinical application. But we are optimistic that uh, someday uh, the uh, TREG based therapy, urban various immunological diseases, or transplantation, uh, or cancer, uh, they all become a uh, in the clinic.